Tonight, a judge is now ordering a psychiatric evaluation on the woman charged with killing her five-year-old son, then dumping his body inside of a suitcase in the woods in southern Indiana. Our Rich and I was at that court hearing last week where Dejan Anderson gave some unusual responses, and he joins us now live in studio tonight with some of the new court filings in the case that are really raising some new questions about her mental health and many of those motions written in her own handwriting. Dejan Anderson wants to represent herself in court, but the judge first wants to know if she is even competent to stand trial for the murder of Cairo Jordan. Judge Larry Medlock has ordered an Indianapolis psychiatrist and a psychologist to evaluate Anderson to provide expert opinion as to whether by Indiana law, she knew the wrongfulness of her actions during the alleged killing of her son. Investigators believe Anderson killed her son in April 2022 because she thought he was possessed by demons. Anderson claims that she is a 63 year old princess and the government has been tracking her, even though it took police two years to find her and arrest her. I am Princess Kalika Hatan Tupac II, representing the entity Dejan Anderson. I have been under surveillance by NSA for over eight months. I also have a detail that follows me everywhere I go from Space Force Military. That was Anderson at that hearing last week. She's already filed several handwritten motions with the court asking to represent herself and for the charges to be dismissed. She says the public defender representing her is a conflict because he is a grandson of President Joe Biden. That's not true. Anderson is due back in court April 25th. All right, Rich, thank you.